welcome. And uh, for those of you who can read, I bear like Chuck Bennett of the city of Salem. And I'm tremendously honored to be here today and to have been invited uh, to speak to you and welcome you to this event. This is a genuine honor uh, to be among you. I want to also acknowledge one of my colleagues on the city council, Ian Benjamin. Korea 
veterans groups lobbied for a change, and rather than honoring the armistice and only those who served in World War I, the holiday, the holiday we now honor, we now honor all veterans from every war and conflict the United States has encountered. We've honored our troops and their service and sacrifice ever since the change was approved by President Eisenhower in 1954. People throughout the country will gather together to remember and to honor those who've served their country. Our gathering is just one small spark in the flame of pride that burns across the nation today and every day. Your presence here today and that of the people gathering across America is a tribute to those lost troops and their families. It's a way to say we remember. From soldiers who shivered and starved through the winter of Valley Forge, to the doughboys crouched in the muddy trenches of France, to the airmen and G.I. Joes who liberated Europe and Asia, to the platoon who patrolled the hazy jungles of Vietnam, and the young man and woman patrolling the mountains of Afghanistan, we remember and honor them all. Thank you for attending today. God bless you and your families. God bless our troops, and God bless you.